Welcome to the video where we're going to teach you how to be a good leader. Number one, a good leader has great integrity. This key component is the foundation of what a good leader is. They're willing to be honest, tell the truth, walk in truth, regardless of their circumstance or who is watching. They know this within themselves and they have no one else to impress. They don't do it for themselves, they do it because it is greater than themselves. So a good leader has great honesty and is truthful and is someone that we are all willing to follow. Number two, a great leader has confidence, but isn't overly confident and is not timid. A great leader must show this resilience towards something that moves them and is able to move others and be a rock in the midst of a storm and be unshaken. Confidence that no matter what happens, this leader will see it through and people will follow anyone who has an unfathomable great amount of confidence. Number three, a great leader knows how to inspire others. This is probably one of the key components of what a good leader is. When the good leader walks into a place or an environment or building, they bring off something that trickles a spark in the people that they're surrounded with. And this great leader always, at most, knows how to ignite people into motivating to move. When all of the talking is done, this great leader knows how to uplift and knows how to control the environment, whether to inspire, whether to rebuke. Whatever this leader does is prestigious and it is an element that we should strive for. Number four, a great leader is committed. No matter what is going on, that leader can look at the goal and say, I'm going to obtain that, no matter what it takes. And this shows not only the character of this leader, but the persistence and perseverance through the challenges of life that regardless of what happens, it's mine and I got this. And everyone who is anyone is willing to follow someone with a vision to obtain. Number five, a great leader is efficient, effective, and clear at communicating to their subordinates or whomever is following them. This is vitally important. In order to lead, we have to understand and we have to dictate and make decisions. And if the people that are following you do not understand what you're talking about, then we're completely lost and our mission will not get accomplished. This leader needs to be able to embody great speaking, listening skills to get the job done. Number six, when it's all said and done, a great leader knows how to show empathy. Leadership isn't just about dictating and taking charge and mistreating one another because we're in a power of authority. No, it's quite 
the opposite. A great leader is one who shows phenomenal compassion, able to humble themselves to whom they are serving, whom they are leading, whom they are helping, and put them first. This is the, this is the core value of a leader. Without this, your people will not be willing to follow someone who is harsh, but someone who is compassionate and is willing to walk with them every step of the way. So to wrap up, a good leader has great integrity, is confident, knows how to inspire, is committed, is an effective communicator, and lastly, a good leader loves their